Hey there, everybody. Gaming Geek back. And uh, where we last left off, that thing was... was Oh, hey, look. The pipe's already in the ground. Okay, someone did that uh, while we were away. I think you sh should think about purchasing a new vehicle. I didn't... But... I, I, I mean, I got money, I guess. Let's see what we gotta do. Drive the flatbed to the... Okay. We could just cancel it. I have a feeling the... Uh, <laughs> I don't know what the game would do if you just cancel your first actual contract. Um, there we are. So look left. Okay, we might have to be that guy in traffic and just kind of push our way in. I'm assuming that they have to. Okay, yeah, we're, we're all right. Sorry, Van. I got uh, I got important places to be. Unlucky. Oh, that is like literally right across from the corner. Okay, that's not that bad then. Down now in the corner. I'm not gonna keep singing because YouTube will demonetize all this kind of stuff. <laughs> uh, what do we got over here? We're at uh, Heisenberg. So I know that's not what it's called, but I know YouTube. They'll be like, oh, he said a word that sounds bad. Okay, what, what do we got? Uh, building materials dealer. Uh, you can buy most material. Most of these are available on convenient Euro pallets, which I'm assuming are just like American pallets. There you are. Park the truck somewhere and talk to the employee in front of the door. Um, if I recall, oh, we don't even have a truck with a, uh, with a crane on it. I really, I, I, it's been a while apparently since I've last played this game. If I recall, there was also a button that showed you the controls. Is it this one? Yes, it is. So we're probably going to want the, um, there you go. We'll probably want those down. There we are. I'm imagining it's probably going to put it over here somewhere. Full disclosure, I've already played a lot of hours of this game, but they've deleted my stuff and I kind of wanted to play it and it's a simulator, which is what I want to focus on this channel more. How's everybody doing? I'm doing fine. You guys doing great? That sounds great. I appreciate you watching. I really do. All right, let's see. Uh, hello, Mr. Heisenberg dealer guy. Uh, I forgot we need pipes. We need pipes, but I want to make sure before I spend my money. <laughs> Uh, actually, let's let's try to get a little a little ahead of ourselves. Drive a small pit. Okay, in the village, did that. Awesome. Get one drain pipe and get one container from a materials trader and transport the cargo to the destination. So we need a drain pipe and a container. Okay, well we can do that. Uh, where's the container? Uh, we need one of those, good sir. And then we need in a, a container, good sir. Thank you. Uh, thank you. I appreciate you. Now you have to rent a forklift. <sighs> so much crap. What does the container look like? Oh. We don't have the truck for that. Okay. That is... That is a problem that we'll deal with later. And we are parked right in front of the pallet. Okay. Yeah, let's let's move this bad boy. Let's move this flatbed. Let's move this flatbed. It's so weird seeing, like, flatbeds like this. Like, I'm, I'm used to... I, I guess just like cab overs like this in general. Like I'm used to good old fashioned American, you know, the the big nose trucks, whatever you want to call it. You know, the the sleeper cabs and whatnot. I'm assuming we have a truck for that already. Yeah, because it said we have two trucks, so we're probably gonna have to grab the other truck. Um, okay, how do we rent? Oh, rental vehicles. I guess I answered my own question. Uh, I would most certainly enjoy renting this vehicle. Thank you. Loaded with a forklift. Remember to open the side panels first. Way ahead of you. Also, they parked the thing right under my vehicle. <laughs> Alright, we're fine. We're fine. Load the pallet. Be careful with the forklift. We don't want any accidents. <laughs> now, nah, we all know what everyone does with the forklift the first time they get it. I've seen so many videos online of people that just do this. They just do like donuts and eventually like it just goes so crazy and so like freaky fast that it, like they just I, I don't know they just fly out yeah all right oh okay oh, that was I was actually kind of getting dizzy um do you lift it like so oh uh, okay all right oh what did I do did I reset? I think I reset the vehicle. Okay. Um, let me see if I can go into free camera. Let's see what we got over here. Uh, okay. I kind of wonder... Nope. 
I want to see if you guys. I, I want to see if I'm capable of doing this, like in in this kind of mode. Probably not. I guess full disclosure, I am I am most certainly not a uh, a forklift operator. Did I get it? I got lucky and almost destroyed it. Okay. Well, now we're in a predicament, aren't we? <laughs> oh, now I don't I don't even have to hold it down anything. Okay, I thought I did. Um, is there like a Okay, so that's how, so we're going to have to help this. <laughs> Help! Oh, oh boy. Um. So I guess are we able to go down and over? Well, now I th I'm f I feel like can I sell this? Is this something that I can sell in return and get a refund? Uh, I broke it. Can I have another one, please? Can I have another? <laughs> Please. I beg of you. Uh, you're not going to let me sell it, are you? Uh, okay, well... Wait, maybe. Nah, I thought there was like a sell option. Okay, well then. Uh, boy. We got ourselves a pardicument again. This is like every game I play, I, I'm in a pardicument. <laughs> Um, okay, so that's your boom back, that's your boom forward. Am I even saying, is that what a boom is? I don't know if there's any way for me to save this. Um, I mean, I guess I could try to go behind the thing. Let me, let me try. So that's your, yeah, there you go. Yeah, let me, let me try this at least. I am probably like the only person that actually has to go off-road in a forklift because I pushed the thing over the first time I, I was needed. This this is uh okay, hello there. This is this is embarrassing. This is embarrassing. <laughs> oh no. Oh boy. Okay. I ooh, ooh boy. Oh boy, this ain't good. Okay. We'll be back. <laughs> and through the power of editing, we're on our way. Um, back to load this up. <laughs> so don't ask me why I'm driving a forklift on the road. This is 110% legal, I believe so. This is fine. This is what's supposed to happen. I could literally cut out the middleman and just drop the pipes over at the shop. But, once again, by the power of it, I want it to make it look like I'm, uh, I'm doing things somewhat by the book. So this, this is, you know, behind the curtains that you guys are not supposed to see. You'll be like, well, how did it get it? I don't know. I don't know how I got it, but he just, he just got it. I could have been that guy. I could have lied to you. I could have been like, hey, guys, I, I, it's, it's on the bed. I did it. But, uh, but I will not lie to you. I, I will not challenge your integrity like that. But what I may say is that I may or may not have reset the uh, the cargo to the uh, to the home base. <laughs> I, I may or may not have done that. All right, so boom out and let's bring it down. Bring her out. Okay, there you are. I'm assuming that's back. And I accidentally reset the vehicle. I keep doing that. Uh, I don't know where to really park this. I guess we can park it by the vans. I don't know why not. I don't know why we couldn't. Unless we just can't drive. Because that's, that's what it seems like it's becoming. There you go. The steering with the back is so weird. Alright, that's good enough. We'll probably need it at some point. Uh, I'm assuming we need to fasten that bad boy. Yeah, there you go. That bad boy's attached. Close that down. I just cured the load. If not, stand beside the flatbed. Ah, it's, it's all right. we, we already totally got it. It's all taken care of. I don't know how we're going to get it off. Unless, uh, actually, I think I know. I think I know how. We do have an excavator that uh, may or may not be able uh, to lift this off. We shall see. You see? That is also another reference. 
Alright, how do I want to park it nearby? I'm fast and load. Alright, I'm assuming that it's gonna have to go. Or it's, it's probably gonna at least have to be grabbed by that bad boy. So, what, what's going on? Yeah, hate. Uh, now you have to unload it. Then we can lay it. Alright, too heavy to lift, don't you think? My poor man. Smart Alec. Uh, don't worry. We'll use the excavator. The tip of the shovel is a hook that you can hook to the pallet. Take a seat in the excavator and move the shovel over the pallet. Hey, I thought you called it a bucket and then hook it on. <laughs> uh, Alright, I'll finish it. I'll try it, I guess. I guess we'll try it. We'll give it a shot. Um, am I able to hook on? Can I bring the bucket in? Uh, I mean, it's still attached, so that might be our first mistake. Um, okay, I would assume it would probably be like, hey, oh, wait, wait, wait maybe. Okay. Alright, where are we dropping this? I don't know. I think literally right by our feet. So if I just... Like, like right here like oh, okay all right it's sure uh, all right all right boss I, I think I did it <laughs> that one well pipes are loaded and the boys can continue well I'm gonna return the truck and the expert to our compound you can return uh, the container over there to the gravel pl wait to uh, you could return the container over there the gravel plant uh, okay I guess he, he was wondering how I was gonna do that too it's waiting at the compound if you want uh, to take a walk. If you don't want to take a walk, you can take a taxi. Use the button on the truck in the upper left and select your desired vehicle. This will transfer you directly to it. Okay, I'll give it a shot. Way to break the uh, the fourth wall, buddy. Now we hit that. I want the deposit to bear. Because I don't feel like taking a taxi, even though that's what we're doing. I get the container at the construction site and bring it to the gravel pit. Didn't we already, like, rent a... Uh... Come on, buddy. Stupid. <laughs> How could be so stupid? Uh, did we already rent a container though? Are we gonna also need another container? Cause we still we have one rented. So I I don't know. I don't know. I definitely see it though. All right, no one get up my butt. No one starts sniffing it. Parking in the right position so we can load it. All right, cool. All right, well, that's fine. I guess he'll do it for me, even though I was clearly fine doing that. All right, extending it. Load the container. It's almost as if I haven't had to do anything. It should be good right there, right? Connect it, and then literally just retract it. Some of them you can go out. Okay, I guess you can on these, too. All right. I guess I really didn't have to. It seemed like it had, like, everything adjusted for me. All right, we got gravel. No, we don't. We don't have anything in here, but sure, we'll, we'll take the gravel. That is totally in this container. I cannot drive faster. I'm not trying to, buddy. Is it not secure? Um, do I need to, uh... Do I need to bring the booms in? Okay, I guess the, the booms needed to be in. I guess that made a, a big old difference. Supposedly, I guess. Dude, oh wait, maybe we're getting gravel. That makes sense. Maybe we're getting gravel. I If I read, you guys probably read. I did not. <laughs> Reading is a very uh, complex skill. Let me tell you what. It's not, uh, not the easiest thing to come by. I mean, I barely speak English, let alone read it. I have no idea what the speed limit is. I know what the lag limit is, and I've already exceeded it twice. <laughs> and what do we got over here? What do we got over here? We got to make a nice little turn to the gravel pit. Which, uh, that I think is like the floral pit. <laughs> I got the... What were they called? Greenhouse, I guess? I mean, it is a greenhouse, I think. I think eventually, like, you can do parks and... and like stadiums and, and all that. Eventually, you might need some like foliage. Fol foliage? Foliage? Fo I don't know. You need plants, you need greenery. That's where you get it. There you go. Have at it. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. I can't English very good. Let me tell you what. <laughs> Let me tell you what. I cannot English very well. 
I think we're almost, this is actually kind of a detour compared to like everywhere else we've been. This is kind of nice though. We've got a nice little scenic, uh, nice little scenic view over here. I'm liking it. This is kind of cool. This is kind of nifty. Ooh. Oh, but what is that sign? I am not familiar with any of these signs. I'm, I don't even know where this takes place. I'm assuming over here. I mean, we're driving on the right side of the road, so it, that kind of stops. Yeah, or, or, that kind of gets rid of some of the things. All right. Some of the possibilities. All right, what do we got? Extend the boom. Oh, I drop it off here? Okay. Bag it up. Bag it up. Bag it up. I don't know why we're dropping it off over here, so I need to extend it and lift it. We have liftoff, boys. Uh, and <laughs> yeah, we could have left it down gently. Uh, retract the booms and return to our compound if you want. If you don't want to drive, use the transport function on the top left corner. You can you, yeah, you can use that to have your supplies delivered. Try that out and have your deposit tipper delivered to the company premises. Alright, so it's wanting me to try it out. I don't know what you guys want to do. I'm assuming we can go to the home base. Is that what he's talking about? Do you really want to reset? Yes, I do. I, I will... I'm asking. I'm asking. I'm reaching out to you guys. Park the truck and come over here. I, I, am, I am reaching out to you. <laughs> Would you like for me to uh, make this more of a realistic thing I guess I should say where I keep digging until I'm done or would you rather have me skip it would you prefer if I use the teleportation stuff or would you prefer if I actually physically drive places I mean this is not exactly a roleplay esque type thing right now so I am putting it in your guys's hands could, could you could just give me some feedback what, what, what do you guys want you want a more realistic playthrough where I do a lot of stuff by hand? Or would you kind of like just a quick, you know, let's, let's finish the dig and let's get on to transport and stuff. Because this, this basically is the dig transport simulator. Um, but it's kind of fun. You get to see a bunch of different things. Uh, anyway, I will catch you all later. Bye, everybody.